I'm Brian Regan. I was born and raised here in Colorado. I've been fly fishing probably since I was about 10. There's a lot to it. Uh, it is an art. I also like the fact that you're with nature. It's not really about fishing, but just being in nature. So on a day where you don't catch anything, it's, as they say, it's better than being in the office. I met my wife, Heather, actually through my sister. My sister obviously knew that I was dating and, and hadn't had the greatest of luck, and she'd met a teacher who was having the same bad luck, and uh, that's, that's how we met. My wife, Heather, and I, we both really enjoyed family. We spent a lot of time with family. But for fun, we used to hike, bike, and kind of stuff that I like to do. And if I wasn't pushing or gunning for a hike on the weekend, she was. We were planning um, some winter activities. In fact, uh, we were planning to go uh, snowshoeing uh, the very next weekend. But I had left with my brother and my dad to go hunting in the area we were hunting. The cellar reception was a little broken up, but uh, kind of looked at my phone and there was uh, 12 voice messages. And I knew instantly that something was wrong. I picked up the phone, I called her, and it was, and sure enough, it was a, an ER doctor um, from one of the hospitals, and they had told me that my wife had fallen while she was walking her dogs that morning. The first thing that this doctor said to me is, your wife's in critical condition, and, and this is serious. How soon can you get here? When my wife died, obviously it was very unexpected, and I, I um, being younger, my wife and I had not talked a lot about, obviously, funerals and what would happen if we died, um, where would you go, what kind of services. When you're in that state of affairs, when you're in shock, it's, it's incredibly hard to make decisions. It helps to have somebody there that, that really listens to you, listens to who you are, listens to who your wife was, and respects what direction to go with that. But overall, it was just their, their care and consideration. And um, I think some of that too comes from them being a family run organization. Just after my wife died, you go through a period of shock and I obviously went through that and uh, it takes time for this stuff to set in. About a month after it, it really hit, hit hard. And so I reached out and did the best I could. I looked uh, for support groups and there really wasn't much out there. And then one of my, my siblings had given me a packet that came at the funeral and it had information on Heartlight. And so I, I started to attend groups there. I truly credit it as one of the things that really saved me and um, offered support when a lot of other people just felt uncomfortable or didn't want to. It's probably one of the best adjuncts, I'd say, to um, Haran and uh, what they have to offer. Support is most important to me. Support for me and my family at the time of my wife's passing, and I still feel that same support today. Learn why more people are choosing Haran and McConaughey, and get your free Leave Well Planning Guide and DVD at HaranCares.com. Haran and McConaughey. Live well, leave well. Plan today.